Good morning, everybody. After a few technical difficulties, we are here with the next part of our Pokemon Platinum Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. Let's check out our team real quick. We got Callie the Weavile, Gorbis here, Boris the Slacking, Unlock the Drifloon, and Pint the Crawdon. I think we're going to get Unlock some training real quick. Hello, Roy. Whoops, Alden, did you got the gym badge, huh? Eternity City is the next place with a gym that gives away badges, right? So yeah, I went to Route 207, but you can't go there without a bicycle. It made my team battle and toughened them up, so it wasn't a waste. So, I'm going back to Jubilee City. Next stop, the Eternity City Gym. Ten seconds before I dash. Nine, bah, who's got time to count? Not him. Turns out. Never battled this trainer. Biker Malcolm. I'm pretty sure that I cannot hit this. I forgot that Callie was our saving grace in that last uh, gym battle, and so she's the only one that's trained up. It'll be alright. We'll make it through. Should click Zap Cannon, but it probably would have missed. This should kill, right? Stab. Yeah, nice. Goodbye, Mr. Firo. Unluck hit two levels. Good work. Callie leveling up again. When Callie gets an ice type move, we're in business. We, because this is a randomizer, are going to go check downstairs in this little gate before we head out. Because I'm pretty sure there's something down here. Hello, Sand Slash. I think I'm fast enough. I hope I'm fast enough. Nice. Good work, Drifloon. Ooh. Pokeball. So many rock smashes. Punishment. That's a dark type move. But I'm pretty sure it's a bad dark type move. Oh. Thought everything froze, but it was just uh, a reg ice. Hello, reg ice. But I dum bum. This music slaps, dude. I did kind of call that, but only because Weavile's ridiculous. I'm not even gonna fight this thing. Can't explosion on me. Can't do nothing. Just because Weavile is stage two, and is gonna have better moves than everyone else, and carried us through that whole gym, so she's my highest level. Hello, Mr. Bidoof. Looking classy and normal here in the Sinnoh region. Oh, another legendary. My whole computer froze again. Nope, just a E-Train. Isn't this what we ran into in this cave? And it struggled to death? I'm like pretty sure. We never battled her either. We skipped all the trainers last time. We were trying to rush it. Well, I would stay in, except you'll kill me in one hit, so I won't. Do I have anyone that isn't Weavile? No. It appears this is the Weavile run. Callie the carry. That's true. That's true. The true carry. Look at this powerhouse move set. Rock Smash, Fan Attack, Zap Cannon, Quick Attack. Ain't nothing standing in my way. There should be some good experience for Unluck. Level 9, good. It's been so long since I played a 4th gen game. I feel like you gain experience so fast. Hi, Mr. The Looker. Tell me, have you not obtained a Palpad? It's not. Is not a Palpad free to anyone visiting the Pokemon Center's basement? 
Anyway, there appears to be no one shady in Jubilee. I shall therefore take my investigation elsewhere. But my friend, I suggest you remain vigilant for shady grown-ups. I will. Shady grown-ups, beware. I shall destroy you. We're going to try to get unluffed to like 12, and then we're going to start training up either Goribus or Crawdon. Probably Goribus, just because of the moveset. And we already have a dark type. We are... How many balls we got? We got enough. We are going to get a new encounter in this cave above Jubilife, though. Oh, but not before this. Now, now, now. P Professor Rowan, you must comply. Hand over all your research findings. For free, naturally. Failure to comply will result in a painful time for your assistant. Algins, well, how is the Pokédex progressing? Hmm, that's Orberg's gym badge, I see. But hadn't I given you your first Pokémon only recently? Perhaps being a trainer is like second nature to you. Or fifth nature, or sixth nature, you never know. Oh, Professor of Pokémon, must you be so difficult? We are speaking to you on business because this is work for us. What we're saying is, we demand you comply with our demands. Quiet, you lot. Why must you be such a nuisance? Let me list some lessons you still need to learn. 1. Don't loiter about for no good reason. 2. Don't interrupt others while they are attempting to converse. 3. If you don't get your way, don't raise your voice to be intimidating. 4. Don't think you're, you've grown strong just because you're in a group. 5. What is with those outlandish outfits you have on? That wasn't even a rule. My goodness, you call yourselves adults? You kids. Don't grow up to be like these sorry specimens. Eee! You had to make this personal. You have forced our hand into making a show of force. Duh. We will make you regret insulting Team Galactic. You kids, give these thugs a lesson in civility, please. Altons, let's battle together. Alright. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can smell what moves every Pokemon has. Couldn't keep up with a double battle. I mean, I don't want to switch Callie out and get her more experience, but I have to. So here we go. A critical hit. Nice. Good Ember. Almost took him out. That's bad. Gotta faint attack that guy. Oh. It really can't take double battles. Unluck finally leveling up. Yeah, pretty much. It's chest, but with super effectiveness. You leave us no option. We will retreat for now. We shall do so because Team Galactic is benevolent to all. Yeah, sure. Run, you pansies. That lot. They call themselves Team Galactic. When Pokemon evolve, they seem to release some type of energy. However, I believe that it's a mystic power far beyond our control. But Team Galactic seems to be studying that power's potential. They want to know if it can be used as an energy for something. Algens, did you know? The professor studies the evolution of Pokemon, too. According to his research, 90% of all Pokemon are somehow tied to evolution. Well, maybe that's the reason those Pokemon or those people tried to take the professor's research data by force. That's really unforgivable. It's all over, so you can relax now. Still, thanks to you two, nothing came of that situation. I appreciate that. Incidentally, Algens, kudos to you for your battling skill. It got me thinking, why don't you collect all the gym badges in Sinnoh? Doing so, you will be sure to encounter lots of Pokemon. That, of course, means your Pokedex pages will continuously fill up. In other words, it will be of great help to my research. That said, I've given you your first Pokemon and Pokedex as yours to keep. You're free to do with them as you wish. Take care now. Thank you, Mr. Owen. Oh, hello, guy. Oh, that was very good. Nicely done. Truly excellent. Oh, I beg your pardon. I'm from Jubilat TV. 
I'd like you to have something for letting me see that smashing battle. A fashion case. Now we can do contests. You will find a whole spectrum of chic accessories and tasteful backdrops. Dress up your Pokemon and watch their appeal grow. And right now, the TV station is offering its facilities so visitors can dress up their Pokemon. There are also prize giveaways too. Please do visit our TV station. No. I ain't watching no TV. We're getting gym badges. Now, depending on what these trainers have, I think Unluck's actually going to get to fight something in this battle. He just learned Gust. You can definitely kill this. Almost level 12, and then we'll get Gory this up. Not quite. Should have guessed it was a Surskit. See what this lady's packing. Hopefully not some heat. Kind of some heat. A little heat. I think I can take this on. Flinch. That was good damage, though. Oh, and he flinched. Yes. Unluck coming through on his first real battle. Let's go. Some big experience there, too. Almost 13. Yeah. Nice. Oh. I literally didn't move. I turned sideways, and he came out. I am going to hit this, though. Hit level 13 on unluck. The unluckiest number. Goodbye, Hitmonlee. Hello, level 13. Your stats are garbage, but that's okay. When you evolve, they'll be better. Yeah, let's do Goibus first. Oh, wait. Let's switch out Boris, actually, because he's got Yawn to catch whatever we run into. You battle? Nope. Come on. Master Ball. Black glasses. <gasps> the black glasses. Guys. I believe a Weavile has now become the strongest. For those of you that don't know, this item makes your dark type moves do 1.5 times damage. And my encounter in this cave is... a Pidgey. I'm fine with that. It will probably honestly replace slacking in our team. Because slacking has truant, and I don't like that. And also, big old turkey bird slaps way harder than this guy. Come on, baby. Yeah. Thank you, Pidgey. Pidgey, the tiny bird Pokemon. It is docile and prefers to avoid conflict. If disturbed, however, it can ferociously strike back. Nice. What do we nickname a female Pidgey? Hmm. Hmm. Female Pidgey. Let's go with Molly. And you know what? Maul is getting trained up first, actually. Sorry, Matt. You're staying down there. Is there anything over here? There's lots of boulders. There's bound to be something. Ooh. Pokeball. TM13 Sucker Punch. 
That could be really good. But faint attacks better than Sucker Punch right now. Nope. I want to run, but I have a sneaking suspicion that this thing is much faster than I am. Nice and faint attack, taking this Dodrio out, I'm sure. Actually leveled Cali up, okay. Calm down, Cali. Let me out, let me out, let me out. Thank you. Route two, I believe this is the same route as before, so no new encounter. But we did just get this Pidgey. We're about to get trained up a little bit. Weightlifter Tia. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I think this is a job for Matt. I am scared of this thing, but water type is quite effective. And I should have plenty of potions. Fury attack. That's going to do more damage than I want it to do, I'm sure. Six. That wasn't six, that was five. I can't do math. Seven. Okay, so just two at a time. Not as much as I thought. Whirlpool. Not a lot of damage. Quite effective, though. Should do more than normal. Okay, good. And he was trapped. The horn attack, that's going to do more. Okay. I'm going to heal up next turn, I think. Oh, wait, does Whirlpool go first? Like, do I hit first? Am I faster was my question, but I didn't say it like that, because I'm a fool. Horn attack, how much does this do? Nine, okay, that's fine. Whirlpool again, I do go first. Nine again. I'm gonna go for confusion because I think Whirlpool has like an 85% accuracy. And I ain't risking that. It should be big experience for both of them. Molly hitting eight. Molly hitting nine. Got gust. Okay, perfect. Matt almost leveled. We'll stay in just for the experience. And then we're definitely gonna have to swap to Cali on this one because of the ghost typing. Get a decent experience on everyone else now, though. That's worth. Faint attack. Oh, okay. Cone. You know you want to. Nice. Cali the Clutch Carry coming in. Big experience on Matt as well. Real quick, before I forget. Let's give... Nope, not that one. I'm a fool. Let's give Matt a little bit of eleven. Spell tag. That increases my ghost type moves, I'm pretty sure. Wrong button. I'm spamming too fast. It does. Let's give that to my ghost type. We're out here. I'm battling everyone I can, because I really need experience for my team right now. A spirit tomb. Well, Molly cannot fight this, so it's going to have to be Cali once again, I think. Yep, it is going to have to be Cali, because Matt can't hit with the confusion. This, this mon took out like three of my mons in that battle. That I lost all those mons in. This mon right here. He's the worst. Does the black flute snap me out of confusion? I can't even use it. So no. You gotta break through confusion and land a 50% zap cannon. Okay, let's go, Cali. Cali, don't play around. And get the guaranteed paralysis. Let's go. It's fine. Spite my zap cannon. I don't even care. I don't need any PP on Zap Cannon. I'm I'm faint attacking. Callie ain't confused. 
She knows exactly what she's doing. Look at that. Oh, because he's part ghost. I forget dark is neutral. I can hit dark every time. I should do that. A spinda. Spinda, spinda. I think I can go into this. I might even be able to fight this thing. Although its moveset's going to be really annoying. Gust. Nothing. Okay. Well, we have to switch already because this is going to hurt. Yep. Oh, but if we switch into this... We avoid it. For free. I'm assuming that that lets, that, that, um, let's go was to Callie hitting a 50% zap cannon while being confused. Oh, did you just use Gust? Okay. This battle is definitely going to take a little longer, but more experience on my weak guys, so it's worth. I believe we're going to get a couple more encounters up here. Oh, wait. We're not even close to Eterna. We have to go through Florama Town and the whole Valley Windworks. I don't have cut. I do want to battle them. Ember. Trash. A legendary. What could it be? Hello, Moltres. How are you? Looking pretty fire. Get it? Moltres fire. I shouldn't have ran. I should have just uh, swapped. I'm gonna heal up. I'm gonna go battle those twins real quick. Thank you, Nurse Joy. We'll just make this easy. If I talk to them one by one, do I battle them one by one? Nope. Beautifly and Houndour. Oh, I can take this. Oh, I can easy take this. Okay, so we're going to gust the Beautifly, and we're going to rock smash the Houndour. It's not super strong, but it should one shot. Nice. Molly leveling. That means this gust is going to hit harder. That absorbs doing nothing to me. Nothing at all. How much are you doing with this gust, Molly? Not enough. Goodbye, beautiful. I get big experience. Thank you. Six more levels and Molly evolves. Molly's at 12 now. Whose turn is next? That would be Matt. I'm going to use one ball. I probably need some more potions, though. I have battled quite a few people. <gasps> What's this special shot? King's Rock? Shell Bell? Okay. Worth. I my supers. Do I have anything to sell? No. Oh, I got Lava Plume at some point. Yep, we're selling that one because it's bad. And mostly so I can buy eight super potions and not run out of potions. Can anyone learn Lava Plume? No. That would have been cool, though. Can anyone learn Ember? Everyone can learn Ember. You've probably got the best special attack right now.
think we just go over here. Route 205 is a new encounter. Help, help, trainer, please. I want to see my papa. My papa and I lived at the Valley Windworks, but then a whole bunch of people dressed like spacemen came. They kicked me out, and they're making my papa do something. Please, trainer, I miss my papa. I don't want that video on the internet, please. Sure, I will stop your, them from getting your papa. No blackmailing today. What is our encounter going to be on this route? Let's hope for some good luck. Give me Gastrodon. Give me a Gastrodon. <gasps> Wait. I'm so sad. Okay, okay. We're gonna try. I'm pretty sure, though, that this guy just has a roar, and he's gonna roar me away, and I'm not gonna get to fight him. Okay, we got leered. Okay, that means I have to switch, which kind of sucks. I think we just have to go into Cali and get some damage off before he roars. Or hope. I'm glad I switched. That would have been... I would have lost my Pokemon. Can you paralyze electric types in this gen? We're going to try. We're going to try my best. If this paralyzes him, we are having the best luck. Paralyze. Yes! It does. It does paralyze in this gen. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're going to try to hit him with another one. We only have one more left. Okay, perfect. Do some decent damage. Get him in the yellow. We're never catching this thing, but we're going to try. I think I can hit him with one rock smash, so I'm going to... Okay. Perfect. Perfect. We got two premier balls. Let's go. Give me the luck in the chat. Nothing. He ain't even wiggling. He don't care about me. Callie, intimidate him. Scare him into this ball. We got a paralyzed in the red Raikou. He's not even wiggling. He doesn't care. Knock on wood, it appears he doesn't have roar right now, though. Which is solid for us. We do only have Pokeballs, which kind of sucks. He, he don't care at all. Okay. We are going to take this next turn to heal up to avoid a crit, just in case. Paralyzed. Good. We only got the one. That's okay. We'll get there. This is going to do more than it should. Didn't do a lot, though. Come on. Come on, Raikou. Get on my team right now. Raikou, you know you want to. You know you want to, Raikou. We got 16 tries left. It's going to be on this one, though. He, he literally does not shake at all. I don't even know what the chance to catch this is. It's like a 0.2% or something, probably. One. Two. Oh. I have a 1.234% chance? Dang. Well, we're getting it. We're getting this 1.234%. Thirteen balls. Unlucky number. Nope. Ain't having it on that one. Come on. One of these times he's just going to struggle and die. It's going to be really sad. Or I'm going to run out of balls first. We'll see. We're at 11. Come on, Raikou. I want you so bad for my team. You're my favorite dog. 
I don't care about Suicune. I don't care about Entei. I don't care about Labradors. I just want you, Raikou. That's all I want. Please, hop in my team. The Dream Team. You'll replace Slacking. We'll kill everybody together. You'll be my best friend. Ten more. Come on. Raikou, please. I want to give you all of my love. Just accept my love. Here it is. My love. My love in this Pokeball. <gasps> my heart is racing so fast. Come on. Raikou, I gave you all my love. That's all I could give you. Please, don't make this a tainted love, Raikou. Paralyzed again. Okay. Come on, we got six more Pokeballs. Come on. One. I don't think he's having it. It's not looking, not looking good. But maybe on this one. Nope. Nope. Four more balls. I think he only has leers left, which is cool. We got three more Pokeballs. Oh, no, he does have bites. That did a lot more damage than I wanted it to. So we're going to have to use another Super Potion for our last two Pokeballs that are not going to catch this Raikou because he hates me. Raikou, my pretty baby boy, please get in one of these two Pokeballs so I can win this Nuzlocke very easily. It doesn't appear that he likes my singing. All right, the ball of destiny. I'm channeling all my love into this one, Raikou. Please. He hates me. Well, we tried our best. Thank you for the level on Cali. Callie, you're still the carry. You're still uh, the only Pokemon I can use legitimately. Luckily, we're going to need a little bit more money before we have to go into the forest because we are uh, completely out of Pokeballs. Don't you dare go into the Valley Windworks. I got ordered to keep everyone out if they're not part of Team Galactic. You're giving me a look that makes me think you're going to try to get in. Okay, then you'll have to battle me. Fine. I'll battle you and clap you. You know, Matt, I think you can take this guy on. How much is this confusion going to do? A lot? That's a decent amount. How much is this going to do? Too much? Am I going to die now? Nope. I was scared, though. Nice. Good job, Matt. Level up. Nice. Water pulls? Agility. Alright. Fine. Isn't that just great? Getting owned by some kid. But you can't do a thing if I lock myself in 
in there with the works key. That's right. The other works key's not here. My cohort in the flower patch is the only other one. Haha, <laughs> in that sense, I'm no longer the loser. Hmm, the flower patch, you say. Onward. Towards where the flowers grow. But first, a quick pit stop. Enough arguing. Hand over that sweet honey. Do as we say. Team Galactic will have that honey. We must have it to attract Pokemon in great numbers. Hey, this kid is a witness. What do we do? We don't need the brat running off to get help. The solution's simple. We ensure the brat stays quiet. We kill him. To death. Ban Pie. Hippopotas. I want to stay in. But uh, I don't want to be here for 45 minutes on this one Hippopotas. Come on out, Callie. Nice. Easy peasy. Fan pie taken down. I'm up next. <laughs> Battling you right after my cohort weaken you, giving me the edge. A blissy. Okay. We're gonna let Matt take this. All this experience. Easily two levels. Never mind, we're swapping. Uh, he doesn't do any damage at all to this thing. Let's see if Molly can get some levels out of it. Because I think I have to use physical move to do any damage. Yep, that was more than uh, my other guy, my Matt. Ooh, good hit. There's going to be some big experience for these guys. Nice. Good job, Molly. Matt gained 300. Molly gained 300. Easy levels. I learned Quick Attack. Nice. A Whale Lord. Gonna get some more experience. In the Cali. The old savior. Okay. How much is that going to do? Okay, more than I wanted it to do. We got to kill him quick. Or we're going to die. We're going to lose somebody at least. Okay. Woo! Good work. Honestly, thank goodness Cali is this high level where we'd have gotten smashed a long time ago. This brat's tough, like really, really tough. Tougher than I can put into words, and I know a lot of words. We're done for here. Let's get back to the Valley Windworks. Oh, what's this? They seem to have forgotten it. It's a works key. It must be for the Valley Windworks. It's of no use to me. You may have it. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. You saved me. Those goons were trying to rob me of my sweet, sweet honey. They sure were weird, though. You saw how they were dressed. What, were they, what they were saying didn't make a whole lot of sense, either. Oh, I need to thank you. This sweet, sweet honey. Go on, take a whole lot. See, if you just ask nice, he gives you some honey. Off to open up the Valley Windworks. Wait. The Raikou was my Valley Windworks encounter. I'm still going to get an encounter on Route 205. That's bussin'. That slaps. Let me in. It's locked from the inside. Use the works key. Kerchunk. And in we go. 
What? No way, you have the key? Locking the door was meaningless. I'm the loser in this after all. This is no time for self-pity. I've got to alert the commander. Alert your commander. See what happens. I'll take your commander's life too. I don't care at all. Ooh, the galactic music though. Bum, 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 bum. It's been a long time. Fan Chloe. Lots of fans. Galactic people are big fans, it turns out. Confusion. This should do a decent amount. It's not stab, but it's a worm pull. Okay. We'll get the experience for Matt. Poison Sting. It's going to poison me on the first turn, because that's how my luck is. How did I know? Wow. Ugh. <sighs> Yeah, that's pretty decent experience for a Wurmple. Now, do I have an antidote? Thank goodness. And I battle everybody, because I am out of money. And I need Pokeballs. Fan Chloe. I do believe they're just all going to be big fans. Confusion. That was more damage than it did on the Wurmple. Crazy. Nice crit. A Ralt. Now I do have to switch because I can't really kill it. But Unlep can. Getting that big damage. Those big sevens. Another crit. Good job, Unluck. Maybe you're lucky. We got 440 for that. Worth. healed up a little bit. Let's take on... I don't remember this one's name. I am one of Team Galactic's three commanders. No, wait. That's one of four commanders. My name is Mars. We've been trying to create a new world that's better than this one. But people have shown little understanding about what we do. You don't understand either, do you? It's a little saddening. So, let's have a battle to decide what we should do next. If I win, you leave. If you win, we, Team Galactic, will leave. Well, sounds like you're bouncing then, homie. I ain't losing. Ace Trainer Sonya. Weasel. More like stupid. That's what I thought. Alright, Callie. Coming to rock his socks for me. Knock this weasel straight off his feet for hitting Swift. Like he knows who I is. Easy claps. Ammonite. You know what? I'm going to stay in to make this fast again. Because this guy is way too high level. Lowered his defense, perfect. He has a berry though, so not perfect. Just an orange berry. Okay, he raised his defense though, that's good. Because we already lowered his defense. Same amount of damage, no defense lower. Perfect, okay. Thank you, Ammonite, for being a fool. And thank you, Callie, for having Rock Smash. Level 20. Some pretty good stats. Still no ice type moves. 1360 though. Oops, I messed that one up. That's alright though. I quite enjoyed our battle. My my, lose to a child, will you? But no matter. We've collected plenty of electricity. 
With the power we have obtained, we can do something quite spectacular. It seems quite obvious to me, Charon. The genius even the boss recognizes. Now, Mars, we should be going. Will you shut it? The boss is the only person in the world who's allowed to order me around. You can keep quiet around me. You only joined us recently. Don't think you're important. I guess it's time to say goodbye and leave for the time being. All right. Team Galactic. They were saying they had to gather Pokemon and energy no matter what. It was for creating a new universe, or so they claimed. Nothing they said made any sort of sense to me. I can't tell you how grateful I am for you saving me. I can finally see my little daughter again. <gasps> Papa! Yuck! Papa, you're stinky. Go shower now, stinky. Oh, sorry. They had me working nonstop. Thank you, trainer. You made those bad people go away. I think the balloon Pokemon will come visiting again. Oh, I'm sure they will, but we can't get them. We already got our Valley Windworks encounter. Oh, hello, Mr. The Looker. Ah, yes, it is you, yes. I've heard that the Team Galactic appeared at this power plant. I have therefore come running. So, the Team Galactic. Where are they? You have run them off, you say? You are a trainer, but... Very well, I shall go investigate. Magnificent. Yes, it is. What you have said it is all true. Superb. Though you are young, you are a trainer through and through. Very well, I shall pursue the culprits. I have received tips that the Team Galactic hideout is in Eterna City. To there, I must be off. Mr. Looker, that's exactly where we're going. How did you know? Alright, let's see if I can go purchase anything. Some Pokeballs, if you will. I can. We're getting 20 more. We're restocked. Let's run into an Entei this time. Let's go. Or a Suicune. Or a Regigigas. How about a Regigigas? That one would be cool. What about a Skyform Shaman? Give me a Skyform Shaman. Alright, Route 205. We'll battle whoever we can, though. Get that moolah. Poet Jacqueline. Sent out Drifloon. Alright. Matt, I honestly don't think you can fight this fast enough. You know, I don't trust anyone else right now. If we had some good typings to send people into, everyone else would be high level too, but I got nothing. Goodbye, Drifloon. Hopefully this levels Matt up as well. Ooh, Drifloon's Aftermath did way more damage than Drifloon did. Goodbye, Poe Jacqueline. Alright. Oh, made it without an encounter. Oh, gotta battle him, though. Artisan Chloe. Smooch him. What sucks about this is that you also can't take this on. You know, I think I'm going to have to switch Matt out. Matt's level 12 now, and uh, doesn't have any good moves. We're going to see if you can break through the confusion. You cannot. You are not my Cali. And Smoochum has Lick, so we're swapping. We're not even playing this game. Well, we are playing this game, but we're not playing this game, if you know what I'm saying. Of course, always has to paralyze me. Got paralyzed on the first turn, nice. Oh good, now I'm confused and paralyzed. And that's when I land it. Perfect. Good work, Callie. Uh, 
unlock hidden levels. Nope, you can't learn focus energy, sorry. Need a ram. <gasps> Finally something Matt can take on. Ooh, Nidoran Sprite looks sick. <gasps> Unluck has been training specifically for this moment. He has a move specifically for this moment. Prepare yourselves for the ultimate powerhouse that is Ember. Quad effective on a Caesar. Almost one shot a Caesar. Let's go. I knew I had Ember for a reason. That's going to be big experience. Yeah, full level, I'm sure. Nice. Level 15. Unlock's getting up there for us, too. What you got here? A dread plate that buffs uh, dark type moves as well. But I already have my black glasses on. I'm gonna go heal real quick and then grab my encounter and then continue on. Counter again. I bet there is an item up here, though. Oh, I have to battle her, though. Oh, I forgot to switch Matt out. I need to train my Pidgey up. Or actually, I can try to train Crawdon up instead of um, Matt now. And see if he has better water-type moves, at least. That might help out, actually. It's gonna hurt a little bit. Everyone leveling or gaining experience. Yeah, Tim's you can train up a little bit. We'll get Molly up in the forest. Hello? Oh, there it is. Mm -hmm. Let's see what that item up here is. A mental herb. That's two herbs. Now we have an herb garden. Biker forest. About to go into the forest. Ooh, he's got a cool ball. Ooh, I should have sent down my Pidgey, but this will be fine. I don't know what he just did, but it don't affect me. Alright, good protect. Not hitting the double protect, though, you fool. You gonna hit the double protect this time? Nope. Pins gaining some levels quick. <gasps> oh, the fish. Hey, core fish. I'm your daddy. Prepare to die. Maybe a few levels on pins, right? Yep, nice. Perfect. Biker Forest is down. 
grab our encounter. Our encounter for this route, 205, is a Skarmory. That's pretty cool. We're basically a bird trainer at this point, but that's also cool. We already got Bubble, which is better than Whirlpool. And he lowered my accuracy once, so he could dodge. It's going to do too much here. I'm trying to weaken him. I don't even know what to hit him with. Oh, lowered his speed, though. Ooh, good hit. That's fine. You can keep sand attacking me. I just want to get you to the yellow. Uh, okay. Thank goodness Pins lived on one health. That was ridiculous and should not have done that much damage. We're gonna try. He did not like that. I wanted to switch and yawn him, but I... But my guy, what's his name, slacking, is really low level. Oh. And uh, I know the one turn I do it, he's going to stop hitting sand attack and click peck. Skarm rejoined the team for me. try it. We're gonna get bamboozled, I can feel it. Oh, yep, he went for an attack that turn. Good. How much is it gonna do? Not very much. Okay, we'll yawn. Alright, now he's at least going to sleep. Perfect. This Skarmory has a very bad moveset right now. Wow. I really thought I had that one. He woke up. We're just going to try to get him to the red. I think that's our only option. One more. One more should do it. That's eight damage. Okay. Now we got to swap. Probably, honestly, back into slacking just for the getting him asleep again. No reason not to. That was a lot more than I want. Oh, and of course, I wasted my full turn. <sighs> that was 100%. I clicked scratch too fast and just wasn't paying attention. I'm just going to try to catch him in the red. I'm not risking my Boris. I'm not risking anybody. Yep. Yep. And that would have killed Boris instantly. Get in this premier ball. Let's see if you just want it fancy. One. Two. Three. Come on. Yes. He did just want a fancy ball. My bad. Sorry, Skarmory. I'll remember that. Skarmory, the armor bird Pokemon. Despite being clad entirely in iron heart armor, it flies at speeds over 180 miles an hour. A mat. Imagine this thing flying 180 into anything. It's going to obliterate it. I know what I want to name this thing, but I think it's too insensitive for YouTube. Um, you know what? We'll just name him... Let's 
this gonna fit? I think it exactly fits. Perfect. Star screen. Let's go. And I think we're going to go switch off a Pokemon. I want to switch off Boris. But he does have Yawn, so I kind of don't want to switch off Boris. But he sucks, and I'm never going to use him, so I kind of do. And I also have to hope we get lucky with our catches. Because I also want the Skarmory on my team. We're just a bird trainer in this game. We got a pseudo Wudo? No, no, no. That, these are our, our dead friends. This is our starter. <sighs> Alright, Skarmory. To the team. Goodbye, Slacking. No more weak links. Is everyone healed up? Yep. Alright, off to Eternal Forest. Artisan Sonia. Ooh. We can get some experience on my Pidgey with this. Once this Pidgey hits 18, also, this Pidgey's gonna slap. It's fine. Lower my evasiveness as much as you want. It does not affect me one bit. Gust. What are you going to do? Hit Fissure? Do it. Fissure me. Do it. Elamize, you fool. Charm. Okay, I think that lowers my attack, but I'm not attacking. I'm special attacking. Yup. Perfect. Should be some decent experience too. I think Elamai's packs a little bit. Yeah, nice. Almost a level one Molly. Yep. Nice. Get tons of money on our way up here. Could have got an encounter up here, I guess. I didn't think about it. Oh. She looked directly into my soul. Do it easy. He lived, but I lowered his defense. Which means he's dying next turn. The levels on these guys is getting pretty up there already. Almost a level for Cali. A mind plate for Matt's confusion. Hello, lady. Never mind. It's going to take me way too long to kill this guy. Maybe not way too long. More than one hit, though, which is what I was expecting.
Hints it in level 12. Molly's almost... No, Molly did hit 14. Good. Molly's almost evolved. Wait, let me see. I think this is a rest house. Oh, all that's left is Eternal Forest and then Eternal Gym. Oh. One sec. Okay, actually, I think this is a good enough place to stop for today. And then next time, we will get all the way through Eterna Forest, battle the gym, and hopefully take on the entire Team Galactic building. Thank you for joining me today. I love you all. I appreciate it. Have a good one. Salutations.